The pop charts are once again dominated by Band-Aid and their charity single, Do They Know It's Christmas, believed to be the fastest selling record of all time. But one song is set to topple Band-Aid's success, and that's Donald Wears Your Trousers by the veteran Scottish entertainer Andy Stewart, proving that the Christmas charts are as unpredictable as ever. I've just come down from the Isle of Skye I'm no very big and I'm awful shy And the last is shown when I go by Hit them and quirks your trousers Andy Stewart is the surprise hit this Christmas Streaking towards number one after a chance airplay Helped by those who remember when Christmas without Andy wasn't Christmas And an impersonation even Elvis admired I don't know how to do that also challenging the charts after a year of acid house hits, Max Bygraves, Lionel Bart and hidden talents from the TV soaps. Record stores say sales treble at Christmas as an army of non-aficionados invades the shops, often attracted by records companies wouldn't give a second look at any other time of year. The stores refer to it as bizarre product. They know it offers an easy solution for the general Christmas shopper baffled by the world of back catalogues and new releases. During the main 11 months of the year, we're dealing with committed music addicts and fashion followers. During December, we're dealing with a lot of people who have never been in a record store or certainly wouldn't think of going into a record store during the rest of the year. Therefore, the type of product we sell is very different. It all started on a sentimental note nine years ago. DJs were less than wildly enthusiastic. We've got a song out called There's No One Quite Like Grandma, and at Christmas, all sorts of things happen in the British charts, and this is to prove they're so versatile, I guess. Cynics took revenge with their own vision of the family Christmas. What am I gonna get for her indoors? I wish it was January the 2nd. And producers invented something to get the whole family dancing. This is the season when the normal rules do not apply. And like dogs hearing a dog whistle, the people who want to buy a record will hear something on the air, they'll want it, they'll think, this is the record for my party or for my relative at Christmas, I'm going to get this one. And once it starts to move up the charts, everyone says, yes, this is what we want. It's the great national joke. And that's what one of these Christmas number one novelty records is, a wonderful national joke.